Hi, today I would like to show you how to convert a PDF into a Google Doc for use inside of your learning management system like Google Classroom or Canvas. So I've downloaded Why We Write lesson. That's from the first week lesson plans inside of uh, Language Arts Teachers. I added it to my Google Drive and I'm going to right click on it and go to open with Google Docs. So that's going to create another copy of that PDF as a Google Doc. When you do this, some of the formatting will change. So it's worth kind of going in here and converting it into a document that your students could write on. So now that they're not going to print it, I'll delete these lines. And then one thing I like to do to help me with grading is to use this button, increase indent. And I might even say, put like a, maybe like an arrow or something, something to indicate to the students that this is where they're going to type their answer. It helps me to move through the grading faster so that their, what they've written is sort of set apart from where my instructions are. Another thing you could do is this type to enter text. I would still indent it so that the students now know that's where they would type. Okay, another thing, this document, um, when it was converted from a PDF into a Google Doc, it looks like there's some strange spacing here, like there's all these lines here. But if I hit my left, I put my cursor right here and hit my left arrow. So there's actually no lines in between there. So one way that you can fix that is you can select the whole document and go to this button, clear formatting. So what that's going to do is get rid of everything. So that's one option. Um, and then if you wanted, you could go back in and sort of make it your own again, organize things. So that's one option using the clear formatting button. Let me undo what I've just done. And then another option is, I'm going to select again, is to go to the line spacing tool. So you could go to um, single spacing. And then also, if you go to custom spacing and just make sure these are all zero, that's going to also sort of get rid of all those really tall lines for you. And then you can kind of come back in and make things look the way you wanted them to. So those are some a few options for kind of reformatting a Google Doc after you've converted it into a PDF.